So let's talk a bit about expository preaching. So um, you labeled yourself as an expository. No, y'all labeled no, me as an expository. No, that's not, no, you just said it. You said, you said expository. OK, so let, no, let me do I that. I said A. Lewis was an expository. OK, you did say that. OK, yeah. you're right. Okay. okay, so how would you label or characterize your preaching? I, I hate labels, man. I really do, because I think okay. labels limit. I agree. I hate that. Um, the way I see myself as a preacher is I try, and then you're going to say, well, that's expository preaching. <laughs> I try to <laughs> expose the truth that the original writer meant from my understanding what they meant when they wrote it, and then to be able to take that and help somebody to apply it. And, and so that's the kind of preaching that I try to do. And I'm, and I'm not even limited in terms of thinking that everybody should be an expository preacher, even though A. Lewis Patterson, he thought that was the only authentic preaching <laughs> is expository preach. But Manuel Scott Sr. said that all truth comes from Jesus. Jesus said, I'm the way, the truth, and the life. Right. Manuel Scott said, all truth comes from Jesus. So whether it's topical or textual or narrative, whatever storytelling, all of it, if it's truth, it comes from Jesus. But A. Lewis Patterson, he used to say that is the authentic method of preaching to expose the truth that God intended when he put it in that word.